I'm the golf pro at St. Louis Country Club. I've been there for 32 years, and um, I always thought there were certain things I couldn't do until I met her, and I found out different, and, and um, I think I can, I'm getting closer to swinging better now than I ever have in my life, so yeah, you're uh, never too old to uh, learn how to play the game, but I met Allison in, um, a year ago last January when we had a power outage in um, St. Louis and she ran into one of my members who was a doctor and they started talking and he recommended that she talk to me and so I came over uh, or she came over to my place and we talked and she wanted me to come train with her so I thought well okay I'll do this I've never trained with anybody I've when I was a kid I squeezed balls and things like this grippers and and did sit-ups and did push-ups and things that you're not supposed to do some of them you weren't supposed to do I found out <coughs> pardon me but I um, started working out with Allison and, and uh, when we got talking about the moves and the golf swing and I, um, you know, at first I disagreed with her because uh, everybody told you uh, basically where the balance of the swing, of your body is in the swing and um, I kind of believed them and after about oh, two months she convinced me that she was right and uh, the balance is more back toward the heels of the body. Uh, it's helped me a lot. It's helped me get to my right side. <clears throat> I told her at the beginning I wanted to get to my right side, so she taught me how to get to my right side. Um, and we just kept training, and I started thinking about it. I started watching um, tour players that played on the tour. I started reading magazines, which I never did. Usually most of the instruction articles were just articles to confuse people to the point they had to come to me to take lessons. So that was the... That's it. And um, so I started reading articles this last year and, and studying golfers and looking at golfers and, and um, seeing how some of the things they were doing weren't right, but yet they were pretty good players. But yet what Allison was teaching me about the core of the body and how you turn and you work towards center, a lot of the tour players are doing it today, but I don't think they know that they're doing it. I don't think they've been taught to do it. They've just found that through trial and error with an instructor or themselves. And um, so I think you're gonna see much more of this once you get teaching professionals, uh, you know, more teaching professionals starting to teach us. I've had tremendous results at my club. I don't even teach much anymore. Uh, I have three other professionals that teach at the club, but uh, I've seen people that she's worked with and I've seen a guy that took the golf club back and it went about 45 degrees past parallel. The swing can't even get to parallel now. He hits the ball farther and about three times straighter than he's ever hit in his life. Uh, we had another one that his problem was he took the club back and he went like this every time on his right side and she, all of a sudden he came to me after about two months of working with Allison and he's take the club back and he was just perfect. And he sat there and he was just hitting seven iron, just 150, 55 yards, just pretty straight, especially for an 18 to 20 handicapper. Uh, you know, he hit it like a five handicapper. And um, so we had some other people um, train with her that have gotten great results. And uh, I've always thought the golf swing worked a certain way. I never knew why. I just, something I came up with over the years that, I felt what I did on a golf swing was what happens. She all of a sudden taught me why those were the things that were good moves to have in a golf swing and why you benefited from them. But I hope to kind of go back to teaching a lot once I do retire because uh, of Allison, you know, what I've learned from her. And it's so much easier. I take students now, I don't even hardly give them a lesson. I work with them for 30 minutes and they just hit the ball so much better. They don't hit it as good as they're gonna hit it, but they hit it better just in a real short period of time. I had to break a lot of habits that I've been doing for 40, 50 years, and it wasn't gonna happen in a period of time of you know, one month. But with, you know, you take uh, a lot of people who only play golf once a week, twice a week, they might be a, a, a 10 or 15 handicapper, you're gonna see improvement much quicker. And I've got members, the higher their handicap, the quicker they pick this up, and it's amazing. When you're an 18 handicapper, you can see results in 30 days. And uh, that's what uh, I really like about it. And, uh, but the biggest thing is I've learned so much about the golf swing. And uh, 
you, you pick out the players on the tour today, I can watch them. I watch the ones that work away from center, then I watch the ones that work toward center. And that guy that works toward center, he's five foot nine, and he hits the ball about 310. And I'm thinking, how can he do that? I've always wondered, how could he do that? You know, and now I know how he can do it, because he works toward center. And that's why guys like Charles Howe and some of these guys hit the ball so far. And I think you're just gonna see it, and that's why golf has never been uh, a sport where size meant everything. And take Hogan, he was only five foot seven, and yet if you take Hogan, you could tell he worked toward center, but he never talked about working toward center. But he probably didn't want to tell anybody either. <laughs> but uh, anyway, I, uh, I can't say enough about Allison. She's really helped me, she's helped my members, and um, I think you're gonna see more and more. She's on the leading edge of this fitness, and she's incorporated in with the golf swing. She's also working on baseball, polo, and uh, some other things. But uh, uh, I, th I think if any of you get into it, or some I think are already into it, I'm not sure who, but um, uh, you'll see nothing but benefit from it. You know, you know in physical, I, you know, I, I used to walk around like this all the time, and I, I actually stand up halfway straight now. I'm still not real straight, but I lost some weight. Uh, uh, I got a lot more flexibility, got a little more strength. So I, I gained a lot of stuff from it. And like Allison said, you're never too old to, uh, to learn something and uh, to improve your physical being. So anyway, well, thank you for being here tonight. Allison here. Thanks for watching that clip. And if you enjoyed it and you're interested in scheduling your own one-on-one -on -one Zoom lesson, just click the link below. Thanks.